family of a man killed in a deadly fire earlier this month wants him to be remembered as a hero. Good afternoon and thanks so much for joining us. For Fox 5 News at 4, I'm Christine Spiro. Stacey Redmond was one of three people who passed away from the blaze at a boarding home on State Street. But his family says if it wasn't for his actions, things could have been much worse. Fox 5's Mary Smith is live outside the home where this happened with the story this afternoon. Mary? Yeah, Redmond's brother said that he always had a protective spirit, so it's no surprise to his family that he alerted others when this home here on State Street went up in flames earlier this month. My big brother. That's who he is. Excuse me. Courtney Redmond fights back tears when remembering his brother, Stacy Redmond. He was one of three people who passed away in a fire at this boarding home on the 1000 block of State Street. Those who escaped say one of the victims told others about the blaze. Because of where the fire started, he was the first one to notice the smoke. And the first thing he did was got up and called the landlord as he was making his way to all the other apartments trying to get everybody up and out of there. The fire happened early in the morning on December 13th. Redmond says his brother's heroic actions are not surprising. As a family, we were not shocked. We were not surprised. That's just who Stacy is. Um, he's always willing to try and help other people and put so many others even in front of himself. He says his brother was a father to two daughters. He will be laid to rest on January 6th in St. Louis, where he grew up. Always um, independent, did what he wanted to do, whatever it was he put his mind to, uh, that's what he did. And we have reached out to the fire department for the latest on the investigation. We are waiting to hear back. Live in Atlanta, Mary Smith, Fox 5 News. All right, Mary, thanks for the latest from there. Well, it was a